Good morning, dear students. How are you feeling today? You are welcome to our English lesson. Look at this picture. What are they? Yes, you are right. These are planets. I think you understood that our theme will be about planets. Our solar system has eight planets which orbit the Sun. In order of the distance from the Sun, they are Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus and the Neptune. Pluto, which until recently was considered to be the father's planet, is now classified as a dwarf planet. This label is key useful information about planets. This type of information helps people to learn a little about planets. Now, let's introduce with new vocabulary. Repeat after me new vocabulary. Sun, Kun, Sonse, Mercury, Mercury, Venus, Sholpan, Venera, Earth, Jir, Zimla, Mars, Mars, Jupiter, Jupiter, Saturn, Saturn, Uranus, Uran, Neptune, Neptune. Now, pupils, open your books, page number 106, exercise 16. Listen, point, and repeat. Listen, point, and repeat. Sun. Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, Neptune, Our next exercise is exercise 17 on page 106. Do the quiz and collect planets. Check your answer with your teacher or online. You should answer to these six questions. Which planet is closest to the Sun? Mercury, Venus. Which planet is the largest? Neptune, Jupiter. Which planet has got rings around it? Mars. Saturn. Which planet has got 14 moons? Neptune, Mars. Which planet is the seventh planet? Uranus, Neptune. Which planet do people call the red planet? Mars, Venus. Before we will do another exercise, we should review present simple, past simple and the present continuous. The present simple is the verb tense with, which is used to show repetition habit or generalization. Present simple has three forms, positive, negative and the questions. How would do positive form? In the third personal singular, he, she, it, we add s or es to the verb. For example, I do or she does. In negative form, we use don't and doesn't. For example, I don't do, she doesn't do. In question, we use do and does before personal pronouns. For example, do I do, does she do. Past simple is used for past actions. You know that past simple as a present simple has three forms, positive form, negative form and the question. 
Impossible. You know, in regular verbs, we add ed to the verb. We use the second form of the verb if this verb is irregular. For example, I walk it in negative form. I didn't walk. Question, did I walk? Here we have a list of some irregular verbs. Please learn them by heart. Present continuous is a verb tense which is used to show that an ongoing action is happening now, either at the moment or speech, or, or now in a larger sense. The present continuous is made from the present tense of the verb to be and ing form of the verb. For example, I am working. I am not working. Am I working? Our next exercise is exercise 18 on page 107. You should read and complete. You should put these verbs in past simple, present simple or in present continuous. Before we will do exercise 19, we should review interrogative pronouns. Interrogative pronoun is a pronoun which is used to make asking questions. Here we have some examples. Exercise 19. Let's play. You should make questions using interrogative pronouns. For example, what did the ancient Greeks call the sun? Helios. Now pupils, open your diary and write down your homework. To learn new words and to do exercise 9, 10 and 11 on page 73, activity book. The lesson is over. Thank you for your attention and participation. See you on my next lesson. Goodbye.